Epiduo is what I've been using. That's what I've started back using. I used to use it whenever I was a teen, but I had to go back to it because my face has been giving me troubles. So I don't usually put makeup on top of acne because it just prolongs the recovery um, process. And I don't want to be looking acne-fied. <laughs> For longer than I need to so for now while my skin is still trying to clear up we're not gonna use any makeup products I wouldn't suggest it to anybody who has acne prone skin or has acne on their face why are you clogging your pores with that you already have a breakout don't cover it up with that you know what I'm saying just let it go through the process unless it's really really bad and you have like an interview or something and you really just want to cover it up to each his own but I'm not gonna do it because like I said, I work from home, nobody's gonna know. There's so many filters these days, like you could easily cover it up, especially if you don't really have to go anywhere. And then also we are having meetings and things on Zoom these days. So nobody's gonna have to 
really be all up and close and personal in your face like that so it really doesn't matter so my face is pretty much good all i would suggest doing is just putting on some lip gloss this is like a lip plumper it says plump me up it's from victoria's secret child i don't think it really plumps but i honestly think it just makes my lips look shiny so we'll go ahead and apply this Also, if you work at home, I will say that it's not it's not really about what bottoms you're wearing because people usually, if you're having like online business meetings and things, they're only gonna see the top half. If you have something floral, something pretty and chic like this that you can wear, that's fine. I usually add I usually add like a simple necklace. This is my crown necklace. And then I like to add my ring, my little black diamond ring, as well as, as well as my little gold bracelet. I love gold and I really wanna get a gold necklace to go along with it. But like I said, if you're at home and you're on online business meetings, nobody's gonna notice the difference. Like, and nobody really cares, honestly. As long as you look put together, like these little simple pieces add to your look and it kind of helps you look put together. Also, add your little earrings. Earrings are a must, especially if you want to look. Really put together. So those earrings, they're pearl. So they're kind of an off-white. I don't know if you guys can tell from the camera, but they kind of go with this off-white, pearly looking satiny top. After you put on your accessories, I have my little watch on, um, a bracelet, necklace, earrings, next, and you have your lip gloss on. You can add eyeshadow if you would like, but like I said, I'm just not adding anything. If I do, let me, let me just, let me just comb out my hair. Let me do my hair. Do my hair. Let's brush it out. I think it looks good. And, uh... Okay, so now my hair is done. I just got my hair done yesterday, so I already my edges look like they're still done, so I don't really have to mess with that, but make sure you do your edges. Also, if you wanna add to your face, um, if you don't wear makeup and you're just trying to keep your skin clear, then you can just always use like some raw shea butter because it doesn't, personally, it doesn't take me out. It's natural, it's pure. So this is the only thing that I feel like really, really safe with putting on my face. Sometimes I may, to add to my look, sometimes I may add lashes. So I don't think, you don't have to do too much because you're at home. So most of the time I don't wear the lashes. If I know I'm gonna go out somewhere that day, I may put on lashes. But honestly, I've never just been like a makeup girl anyway. And also, this is the edge control that I use on my hair if I do use it. So either even or the edge booster. Edge booster is like really, really good. It holds without crinkling up your hair or making your hair curl up. And yeah, this is the look that I came up with without even having to put on makeup, without you know, anything. I don't have to leave the house, so it's not important. Um, I'm probably just gonna be working around the house today. I'm waiting for some things to come in the mail. And that's pretty much it. And I think I look pretty put together. Like my hair is nice. It's great to always keep your body in shape. Like I said, I like to work out. And um, it's always nice to keep your hair done so you don't have to do much to it. To um, looking put together but other than that that's it that's all I do I literally don't do anything um, I don't do much to keep myself looking okay for if people come by the house also if 
have to run somewhere, do a business run, or like I said, just do an online Zoom virtual meeting. I look good at least from this part of my body to this part of my body, at least, you know? So um, yeah, that's how I keep myself looking put together as a stay-at-home businesswoman. Bye.